Record people's words or thoughts, of course. Alright, and record it speak. Alright. Auntie Amy. Auntie Amy said, said, single past. Yes or no? Yes. Right? That she had never eaten double past sushi before. Is that okay? Can I understand? Alright. One more. In unreal or hypothetical situations, it can be true, it may not be true. It can happen, it may not happen. Alright? If I had known you were in Kuala Lumpur, I would have called you. Alright? If I had known you. Alright? If I had known, meaning here single pass, double pass doesn't apply because this is just a, a hypothetical sentence. That means, you know, it would have happened, it may not have happened, it may be the truth, it may not be the truth. Alright? It's just hypothetical. So if I had known you were in Kuala Lumpur, I would have called you. But I didn't know. So did I call? No. So is that okay now? Can you follow? Okay. Alright. Let's look at the next line. Okay.
daily speech, but sometimes it happens, right? Say something that started in the past and continued up to another action or time in the past. Okay, let's check some of the examples here. Alright. Like I told you, it emphasizes an action that was in progress for a duration of time before some other actions occurred in the past. Alright, let's see. She had been working. She had been working double past. But because it is in progress, in progress, so ing. Can you see the connection now? Alright, it is in progress. So in progress, then there is ing. Double past, but not past perfect, but ing. Because it is still, it, it was happening, ing, in progress, alright? So how? Until the day she retired. Retired single past. So simple past. Is that okay? But the double past we use progressive, not past perfect, but past perfect progressive because it was in progress. So she had been working so hard until the day she retired from her. Can you see the connection now? Can you see the difference? Is that it? And, and, alright? Sometimes all oh, this kind of things, uh, because it doesn't happen in our mother tongue. I believe past, perfect, progressive doesn't appear in, in Korean language. Doesn't appear in Chinese language, definitely no. Alright? Because no tenses, Chinese, alright? Indian languages, they have, but I think Indian languages has got 8 tenses, not 12. The past progressive, well, not very good in 10 also, I mean, no, no, but I know, I think there are 8 different types of tenses in 10, not 12. Alright, so this can be difficult to understand. Is that okay? Okay? Does she need okay? Okay?
Miss Lam had been teaching music since she delivered her first baby. Alright? So, um, any questions here? Can I understand? Alright? So, now I want to go and do some tutorial. Present tenses first, then we will do past tenses. Alright? Finish your present tenses, you get right, we, uh, we take a break, then we continue with the past tenses. Alright? So, please take one each. This is checking your understanding what we learned present tense, past tense yesterday. Is that okay? So we check our present tense first. Alright? Past tense we will check after the break. Okay, please take one each. Please take one each. I think future we cannot do today. We will do next to week. Okay, please um, check yourself, do this, because if you can get this correct, or most of it correct, I think that the midterm exam you will get good marks. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so help each other. Check your notes, discuss with your partner, I'm okay with that. Alright? Thank you. 